Hello and welcome back to another solo <coughs> survival episode. Uh, I've been a bit busy lately, I haven't had much time to record, and I've been doing a bit of streaming lately, so I haven't had much of an opportunity to do one of these two episodes, so sorry for them being a bit of a gap, but it's okay, we're back, I'm trying to organise a proper schedule around my life to get everything working the way it should be, but for now, let's get into this episode. So, today what we, what I want to do is I want to, um, set up... Uh, um, what do you call the stuff that makes you breathe? Uh, H2O oxygen farm thing, right? And I'm thinking the best spot for us to put one of those would be up in this section here. I think I said I wanted to do one here. I actually don't remember what I said I wanted to put here. So we're going to put an oxygen farm here. Um, the reason we're going to do that is one, it lets us continue to build this corridor. Um, we're going to be able to keep building uh, as we go. I think that'll be a very good thing. And two, um, I've already got the gas container down there, so it kind of feels like it would be a good spot to have the H2O generators because the H2O makes oxygen and hydrogen. Um, so I feel like that that that's just a good spot. Now we're going to start by using our little digging machine here. All right, so just that put our engines back on excuse me and we're gonna have to drill out just a little bit of the um just a little bit of this hole low health uh low health today yeah 35 it's fine can we actually are we gonna oh yeah we can fit under here perfectly look at that yeah see so i'm being lazy i don't want to mind by uh drill out by hand so i just hold my right right mouse button we dig a big ass giant hole and that should give me plenty of room to build our thing without getting rid of too much of the asteroid as well. Because we want to keep most of the asteroid. Like, we don't want to have to dig everything out. We like the shapes. Like, I'm going to leave this big, giant bump here, and we're going to dig a tunnel through. That's my plan for that, anyway. But that's the future stuff. All right, let's just... You know what? We'll leave that there so we can see what we're doing. All right. <clears throat> so, first things first... Put that there. How deep do I actually want this? So if we're gonna put that there, um, uh, how far back? So what do we got? We got like this one block, and then that's it. That's the corridor. So here, and then we would have a wall there. Okay, so then this would be the entrance here, I guess. And then we gotta have something like so this will be turned into windows too i'm just trying to map this out in my brain all right so we got that you won't be a thing uh do i have an inventory space probably not here there we go still didn't have the inventory space there you're not gonna defeat me all right so we're gonna have that i think we're gonna need a little bit more room um i just want to make sure there's not like a big empty chasm or something behind this is there no okay good <laughs> like it wouldn't bother me if there was a big empty chasm there i just want to uh, i don't know i don't know what i was thinking <laughs> yeah so we want to dig out we probably want to go uh we don't want to go too far back maybe maybe we want to go back yeah we'll make it like a three by like a f that'll be like what one two three four five already got a wall placed there so be about that big we'll go back about three yeah i think that'll be perfect we just we got to do a little bit more digging um let's just remove this guideline stuff that i was using all right ooh, ooh, don't go too fast it's okay smokey you can take your time all right, all right click there we go. Alright. Is that... Yeah, that's going to be more than enough. Hey, we might even be able to make it a, this room a little bit bigger. Alright. A bit sniffly today. I think I'm getting sick. I don't want to get sick. Being sick sucks. Nobody likes being sick. Alright, let's do this. Alright. Do a wall like that. So we got it a little bit bigger than we intended. And now like a 4x5. Which I'm not upset with. Um... I'm actually fine with that. 
Yeah, we can't put the roof on yet because I've got to move that H2O generator in here. Um, so we put the H2 generator. We may have to disconnect this stuff. <clears throat> Alright, let's. Uh, we're just going to move you out of the way for the minute. Actually, here, can we just. Let me just move you back to about here so you're out of the way, but I still get some light where I'm working. I am getting sick, by the way. Um, this sucks. Hold on one second. Okay, I blew my nose. Hopefully, everything will be a bit better for like five more minutes. <laughs> uh, <clears throat> I don't want to get sick. I don't like being sick. I can feel it coming on. And I'm going to blame everybody but myself. Alright, now. Can we just get this guy in here? We'll move the H2 generator. I think we're gonna need about three of these. Do we have any other ones? Actually, no. Hold on. I think I'm allowed to build H2 generators. I don't know. Well, we're gonna move that one. Um, because I want to move things. It's been a while. I forgot the rules of this world. <laughs> I think I can build basic stuff, right? That was the rule. So. Basic things, a H2 generator would be basic because you need it to survive. But, is that a H2 gen? We got a H2 gen there. And there's another one here. Well, screw it, we're not gonna, we won't, we'll, we'll just detach them. We got these ones here, might as well take advantage of it. I think three is enough anyway. Um, oh, Sparky, where are you? There you are. You're alive. I had a terrible, terrible dream that in my... In another world with Star Trek stuff that was like being broadcast to the universe that you died to radiation poisoning. I'm so glad to see you're still here doing that. I know, it was definitely a dream in the other world because in the other world you were actually doing stuff. I know. Alright, I'm going to leave you to your weird dancing. Um, be good. Alright. Uh, let's do this. Um, I'm gonna need... Uh, what's it called? I think it's called like a world or something in it. World pad. I haven't... it's not... yeah. Play a character. You take that, you take that. Might as well take those. I'm just trying to clear a bit of room out of my inventory. Right now, okay. What's that? Six? That looks like seven. It's alright. I'm fine with having seven. Um, let's disconnect you. Where did it? There you are. Come here, Vector Grabby. We needs you. You have a job to do. Alright. Can I grab this? Alright, like so. Yeah. Perfect. Perfect. Alright. Now... I probably should have grabbed this on from the side. <gasps> I am discombobulated. That's the roof. We don't want to go there. We want to go this way. Alright. Yeah, honestly, I probably should have grabbed this from the side. It would have been easier. That's why we can we can fix that. That shouldn't be too difficult to remedy. Um, let's just put that there, and then. Be careful not to smack the arse of the ship against the wall. And there we go. Perfect. Okay. I don't know how I'm going to go getting through that there. It's like a two... Uh, theoretically, we should be able to skim it through. Um, I don't think... I don't think it matters where the rocks with the H2 generators. I think they're good. Um, we're going to put it in... Okay, the wish the hmm. I think the way we we're gonna put this one in is going to be with that facing outward so we'll have access to it. Uh we just gotta do this very carefully. I think we're good. Uh, go a little bit lower. Just, just gonna skim it underneath that conveyor tube. I mean, we could disconnect the conveyor too, but it's not really going to matter, but... Hey, the less we have to disconnect, the better. Okay, so here's a question. I think, actually, what I should do is I should put this in this back corner first. Um, because 
it's going to get increasingly difficult to get these things in here as we put more of them in so if we can get them put down the back here that'll be great um that's fine calm down oh you won't go down because the rocks are there Techn so it doesn't matter that um the, the H2O generator, I'm fairly certain, does work through rock. Doesn't matter if it's in a rock. But you can't place things on top of this. Did I break this? I did break it. Of course I broke it. The damn drill. It's the most destructive element. There we go. Perfect. One down. And two to go. It's pretty straightforward doing this kind of stuff. So, I think I'll get these done now all right we got all of them all three of them placed I th three should be more than enough I mean there's room for one more on that side if we need to now over here <coughs> over here we're going to need I think we're gonna put uh, should we put the yeah I think we might put the oxygen tanks along here um Let's see, because we put like probably one more hydrogen tank along here. In here, we'll have two. I think two hydrogen tanks should be enough. But, mm. yeah. No, no, we won't be able to fit that. Yeah, yeah, we'll put the oxygen tanks up here. There's not much room going to be down there once, once, once we put the second hydrogen tank in there. There won't be much room for other stuff. Because that water building will probably just go along that line there and then back across there. So, I think this would be the good spot. How many oxygen tanks do we actually have? Um, let's see. This is all stuff from the very first ship we salvaged. What are they? Just a bunch of iron thrusters. Some rocket launchers. Technically, I think those are turned on. Um, yeah, they are on. Do you have ammo in you? You do. <laughs> That'd be bad if anything flies in here. What are you doing, Sparky? Here, do you need a little bit of helping hand? Yeah. Do you, do you need a... Are you, are you stuck? What's up? Are you okay? Is that so? Do you, you want to just follow me for a sec? Maybe we can... Get you up and running again. Hey, look! You ran! Alright, here. Come here. Uh, you can resume whatever you were doing, okay? Hopefully, you'll be fine, right? No, you want to go back to your dancing spot? Oh, no, yep, you want to go straight back to your dancing spot. You know what, Sparky? You do you. You do you, homegirl. Um, oxygen tanks. So we got one oxygen tank there. And it looks like we have a grand total of one oxygen tank. Okay, do we have any that are on here? Ah, that's an oxygen tank. So we got one oxygen, that's a small hydrogen. I don't know how I'm going to get that oxygen tank out. Um, maybe if I get rid of that corner light. There we go. I should be able to disconnect that Low easy health. enough. Is there any uranium in that reactor? No, no reactor is empty. But these old cannon turrets have a bit of ammo. <coughs> Interesting. Okay, so we've got to grab, we've got two oxygen tanks and I think we know where we want to put those as oxygen generators. But we'll put those up on the base at some point. I swear to god, you, you, you certainly are one special lady. She likes to dance, what can you do? What can you do? If she likes to dance, she can dance. It's a free world after all. Alright, so we're going to need at least one, two, three, four of those. Um, I think we're going to do the same thing with them as we did with... I'm going to have to get rid of all that rock. Um, we'll do the same thing with them as we did with the H2 generators. We'll stick them off in this back corner first. I would like to have four of them in the end. Uh, so one, two, three, four of them along there. 
But it does mean we're going to have a bit of open space in here, which is fine. Actually, I don't mind a bit of open space every now and then. I have some ideas of stuff that we might be able to do with them. That Do with them. Do with that open space. So that'll work out well. Uh, put that there. And... No, I'm not going to place that one down. Oh, I should probably weld that, though. Okay. Yeah, I was about to place it down, and then, um... It would have caused trouble with me trying to put down the oxygen tank. It would have mag... I guarantee it would have welded to the wrong pad, and then that one would be in the way, and then I would be able to put the other one in there, so I'd have to unweld it, then replace it. It just would have been a nightmare. Um... Yeah. Okay. The thing about these oxygen tanks is that they look like they're pretty much full already, which is kind of cool. Alright. Now, I don't want to mag... I don't know what would happen if I magnetized this to that thing and then disconnected it. And, quite frankly, I don't want to find out. Um, I'll be honest with you, it's not something I really feel the need to discover. Uh, at least not at this point. Can, come on. Tap the probably very explosive thing. Alright, there we go. Perfect. I love this little vector grabby thing. Um, I think I need to change up the back a little bit. See how we got the straight slopes? I think I'm gonna have to change that to um, maybe the more sharper slope or less sharp slope, whatever. The longer ones because I want to kind of keep that connector there. I don't really want to remove the connector. It's kind of extremely useful in charging the battery up on this thing. It's I use it every time I finish with it. I can just connect to that little guy there and then everything is all good. Sparky, you are certainly having the time of your life right now. Uh, I wonder what music she's playing. What music do you think she's playing in her helmet? Because you know she's listening to music. Like you can't Nobody dances like that, not listening to music. You'd, you'd have to be insane, right? Well, I mean, it is Sparky we're talking about, so I guess anything's possible. All right, whoa, 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 calm down. We just need to do that. Okay. We can rotate, and then we can grab you again. Perfect. Am I going to have room to actually place this? I should have room, right? Little vector grabby here is only um, what is about a block and a half long, maybe two blocks long. Hmm. I don't know. It'll be fine. It's fine. I kind of want to actually place this with the oxygen uh, ridden vertic vertically like that. So we're just gonna. Hey, it's fine. Come on. You don't want to do it because of that rock right there hanging at the edge, do you? You're like, there is a tiny bit of rock right there, and it is stopping me from placing this container. There you go. That should do the trick. Alright, and... Perfect. Oh, that's fine. That's fine. Alright, we got to do that one more time. And another one is done done um that's perfect okay we need one more i i, I feel mm, two more yeah we definitely need two more i don't think we have any more anywhere though there was definitely no more up here uh there's that there was only the one that was on there that we just grabbed now so hmm. i think there's one on here we can't, we can't go salvaging our main ship, though. I mean, could we? No, we can't, we can't, we can't salvage our own ship. Mm, but we could, no, no, bad Smokey. And also, Sparky, come on, my man. You've been, you've been dancing and grooving on there. I think what we need to do is we need to, she might be having sleep depri deprivation, deprivation? God, English is, like, terrible for me today. It's terrible, terrible for me for every day, apparently. Alright, let's go. Are you, you're not, yeah, you are stored in here. Let, let, Sparky, I think you need to have just a little, just a little bit of a sleep, alright? Just store you. 
Okay, and then let's uh let's, let, let's just there you go. You can wake up. Your battery's recharged. Are you happy now? You're a bit. You're blushing a little bit. Are you embarrassed? Are you threatening me with finger guns? And a welder. So you're gonna shoot me and then weld me back up. You know what, Sparky? I like you. All right. Let's move. She's probably going to vent the ship into space. She does that sometimes. Um, now what we need to do... I need to get a script to automatically close these doors. Um, what we need to do now is we need to design the corridor. Now it's not really... Uh, I've vented everything. Um, <laughs> now there's not really much to design if I am to be honest. Uh, I think I should get rid of that. I have all these windows here, and you are. Is there a block there? There's a block there. No, is there a block there? There is a block there. Why is there a slope block there? That's weird. Boom. We can do that. I'm thinking we need girders. I am <laughs> getting blocked by the grabbing shit. Um, girders, windows. Just you can bomb that. I'm sure, that'll be more than enough. All right, we need a one by one window though, not a one by two. One by one, thank you, swap you out. All right, and we go, we're gonna have a bunch of windows. Like so. And then, I think we'll have, should we go? Yeah, we'll go window there, and then we'll go back to uh, armor blocks being like that. Yeah. Your health is low. Is my health low? Is it? Is it really? Um, okay, so what we need now is... I think it's under column, the ones I want. Because why would you not have everything in weird sections? Or oh, whatever. I don't know what you've placed. Ah, uh, yeah, seven. Give me... This one. Uh, no, we don't want the bar one. Let's just go with this one. We have a nice long section like so, then we'll probably just have a good old fashioned armor block there. And then I'm thinking we'll have probably the same deal on this side, but this way. There we go. You can just go, you get an armor block, so you get an armor block too. Bam. Probably do that. Probably have like a doorway there leading through the hole through the asteroid. That'll look good. And then what are we going to have to do? We're going to have to have some sort of half block. Um, so what we can do, actually, hold on. There is a, okay, so vent. We're going to need the vent on the half block vent. That's the half block vent. All right. So we'll put like a vent right here. Bam, half block because it looks sexy and then we'll go with another half bunch of half blocks like so there we go and then here here let's put these up like that what kind of doorway do we want should we go if I grab this what I can do is like something like that and then we'll have a door. Should we have a... Okay, so this is an important area. I kind of feel like we should have that. It looks like a bit more of a secure door. Because you don't really want people in here mucking around. Also... Yeah, getting more oxygen tanks in here in the future will be... We're going to have to grind some stuff down in the future. It's fine. It'll be fine. It's fine. It's all fine. It's... Fine. Listen, I said it's fine, so it's going to be fine. All right. I don't know why people keep insisting on telling me things aren't going to be fine. And by people, I mean myself, because there's not really anyone. There's a conveyor tube in our way. <laughs> um, that's fine. Like everything else in life, that's fine. Oop! Sorry, didn't mean to break you. You're kind of probably an integral part because you look like you're connected to the. The things. Okay, where's the motor? I need just one motor. Okay, I'll take ten. You twisted my arm. 
Alright, well, we're gonna have to do something about that. Um, I'm not sure what we're gonna do about that yet, but we'll have to do something. Oh, yeah, okay, I'm gonna need to get rid of you for a sec. I'm gonna have to boom, boom, float, boom, B, so I can snap it to ground. Uh, actually, let's stick one there. Uh, can I weld that one up? And let's weld this one up, and this one, and this one. And then we can put this one on the ground, we'll weld that one up as well. Alright. Okay, I think that looks looking pretty good. And then, I'm thinking... For the conveyor, conveyor? From the conveyor tubes, what I might do, actually, let's get rid of that and we'll put this here. And you know what, I'm just going to slap something there. I kind of want... Okay. Conveyor tubes. I want access points all around at the station. So if I put this conveyor junction there, and we slap another one there just to maintain air tightness. Um... Use we could use just that to maintain air tightness. Uh, no, mm. you like that? It should remain airtight. Uh, airtight. Three of six. So yeah, yeah, that'll be fine. Okay, and then how are we gonna do this? So you gotta connect these. These three are not connected at all. Um, funny enough. So, we will do T intersections. This, like this. And like that. And then, we should do a curve. Curve one can go in there. Okay, I'm not going to do any more because I need to get some stuff to weld this up. Um, let me through. <laughs> Alright, hold on. I need to get this all sorted. Alright. Um, what's, where's the way I can get through? That way. Okay. I need to weld this part up first because if I don't, I won't ever be able to get to it. And that's going to be a bit of an issue. Alright, so we need that. And I think at this point... We can just go normal conveyor tubes here because um, I plan on sealing this part off to the rest of the base anyway. Okay, so we put one there. What we're gonna have to do is this. Go B. Give me a curvy boy. Like that. Theoretically, that should be connected to that one now, so that should be fine. And then you guys need T junctions as well. Uh, T junctions would be under 8. Uh, Z, T. Like that. We're not going to see you. I'm just going to put it facing this way. Just for that. Leave that T junction there. Um, okay. Yeah, we'll leave that like that for now. Alright, because we're eventually going to have to put another one there as well. Alright, and another T-junction there as well. Actually, we'll probably do a curve on that one, because we can end it. But, I think that'll do everything we need. Um, let's go with a flat one, like so. Then you're going to need to be... I think we can go to normal junctions now, so we can save a little bit on resources. If I can find the damn T. There's the T. And we need... Um, straight. And then we need a T here to connect it up to the rest of the base. Like so. Okay. Energy low. Energy low, no matter construction components. Alright, so I think that'll be the basics of this room. So I'll probably just get all of this stuff welded up right now. Well, after a little bit of welding, I think everything is basically done. What I'm thinking I want to do is I want to put another air vent in here, because I like air vents, right? Who doesn't like a good air vent every now and then? I think we want to put like the full air vent here, just down on this level, because it's 
like, you know, connected to there. I think that'll go well there, if we put that there. Uh, is everything actually connected? Sweet, it is. Isn't that great? Everything is now connected. So we put that there, then we can seal up this area. Oh, well, once I put these. What I'm going to do here is I'm just going to temporarily, we're just going to put these here. Let's, we'll, we'll, oh, we even, we'll paint them red even, so we know these are temporary. Um, I'm out of still plate. Uh, <laughs> there we go. Okay. Put that there, just so we can seal this whole room off. Um, one downside to my design here, it looks cool. I act like it and I'm going to keep it. I kind of like it. It's just, it, we can't really do a double airlock on that one, which is fine. It's not important. Alright, I also want to put an interface. Swap you out. You don't have to be red. Just go back to the defaults. I really gotta go. We gotta go through and color, color, paint the station as well at some point in the future. Okay. Put an interface block there. That way we can access um, the cargo from this section. And I think we will put some doors down here. Can I just grab that? That's all I wanted was to grab it. All right. We'll go with this door. Bam, insufficient space. That's all right. I'd rather have that. So put that door there. And then we grab the rest of the stuff for that one. Let me put this door here. Perfect. There we go. Now, theoretically, if I close this. Oh, I thought you would be airtight. Why are we not airtight? Okay. That's all done. It's going to be one of these. It's going to be these things. These, I don't, yeah. These guys, they say they're airtight, but they're, they're only airtight in one phase. And then if you have like a gap in one, it's weird. All right, so what How vent are you? Critical. You are air vent fan. Okay, maybe, I think the other ones are called air vent fans, fool or something like that. Yeah, they are. So you find my leak. Up there, yeah. See? These stupid things are stupid. I'm just gonna go for conveyor junctions. Um, I think I'm gonna have to, Is it just gonna be the oxygen tanks? I think it might just be the oxygen tanks that we might have an issue with. Inventory full. Bugger. Inventory um, full. Oh no, are you, they're going in the rock. Um, Inventory full. Hold on. Dump that. Give me like three of those. And then let me pick up all of this stuff on the ground. Uh, we have Bob, don't we? Bob probably grabbed all that stuff. Okay, so let's just put that and that like so. Okay. There we go. And then let's just seal this hole up. Alright. How are we going now? Now we are oxygenated. Okay. Excellent. It was only the... the See, the problem with these vents here is like where they connect. You see how there's like you can see through and see the wall at the back there? Well, that means that's not oxygenated. That means air can flow through it. It's very, like, it makes sense. It, it's the way it, that's the way it should work. That shouldn't be airtight, but it's also kind of annoying when you just want to build. Um, but anyway, it's whatever. It's fine. It's done. It's fixed. It's good. We are good to go. Oxygen here, oxygen here, sweet. I like it. I like it a lot. Now, I need a drink. And I'm not streaming. I could have paused the recording to do that. It's fine. I apologize. Now what we need to do is we need to put some lights in here. So, I'm thinking, I'm thinking corner lights in this room. Um, simply because I don't really have them anywhere else, any other way of putting lights in here because these are half slabs. I mean, we could take out, um, let's say like this, how many, is this even odd? One, two, four, five, six, seven. So it is odd. So one, two, three, four. So if we took out that one, that would be the middle kind of feel like kind of feel like I should move that there 
if I move that there, then we can put a... Okay, okay, we're gonna do it. Alright, we're gonna lose a bit of oxygen. It's fine. Wait, how was that even... Oh, you filled up from the one in there. I didn't connect this one. Oh, whatever. <laughs> uh, it's fine. So, we want... I guess this is the fourth one, right? So, one, two, three, and four. We want the vent here. You can go there. And then what I'm thinking, to get extra fancy with everything, is... I kind of want these to be the same colour. Boom. Boom. Alright, and then let's get rid of all of these. Okay, like that. And like that. And then we can use the light panels to fill in the gaps, alright? So, light panel. Light panel. Just grab enough stuff to do everything. Theoretically, this should all be airtight now. Yep. Look at that. Airtight. Do we have air to fill in this room, though? There we go. <laughs> I think that, that... Oh, no, that vent wasn't actually connected, that's why. Alright, so we do that. Now let's go light panels. Actually, we also need a light in here, so we'll probably just... Let's just slap one... Like right there. There we go. Now we can do all of these at once. Alright, go light. I'm gonna guess it's these ones. So we're gonna call these H2 Core. Alright, okay, because it's the corridor. And then we just call this H2 Room. Like that, just so I can remember what they are exactly where these lights are. You go to about 18 meters. Whatever that'll do. Uh, intensity always down to two. There we go. And while we're here, I just don't show these on terminal. Um, they can stay. Uh, show block on terminal. We're just trying to like clear this out because look at this thing. It's giant. Your health is critical. Is it? It's been critical for a while, I think. Oh, that's right. We have Bob. I keep forgetting that I put Bob on, and I said I could have one just to do the repairs to the ship and stuff. But yeah, what do you think of that? I think that corridor looks interesting. I don't hate it, actually. I think it looks... It's an interesting design, and it works. Alright. It's definitely unique. <laughs> it's definitely unique. Maybe what we can do... Is... We got, like, the new decorative box. Where are they? Decorative blocks. Is Sparky around here? Sparky! What are you doing up there, buddy? What are you doing? You chilling? Is Bob the supervisor making you work? That is what I hired him for, I'm sorry. Anyway. Um we got these blocks. I don't know what I don't know what block this is under as like a group. Are they not grouped together? It wouldn't surprise me if they're not grouped together. Uh, would it be under interior? Interior lights. No. Passage. Ways. No, you're not under passage ways. Um, yeah, I don't, I don't know what they're under. So let's have a look. We can put a couch. I'm not going to put a bed or a bookshelf. And maybe we can have a button panel and an entertainment console. Uh, do we really need an entertainment console? Probably not. Button panel will be nice. Um, so you'll have that one with three buttons. I don't know what we're going to assign the buttons to do. And then we could have a couch or trees. So maybe we can have the trees over there. And then we'll have... Trees over the trees there, we'll have the couch there, and then we'll have this random button paddle. I'm sure that'll be fine. Let's just vent everything into space again, and then we'll have to get rid of this rock, I think. Just a little bit. Actually, I think we have to get rid of all of it. I'm pretty sure some of these. Not all of the Not all of the um these guys uh where the hell did I put them there? 
But all of these require you to have like a hundred percent clearance of rock and stuff, but some of them do. Okay, it's weird. All right, we do that, and we'll put a couch there. All right, bam, bam, and bam. All right, perfect. I'm just trying to like give the corridors energy low some like thing, something to do. Maybe what I can put here... I know what I can do. Okay. Uh, the lights that I just hid. I can have so many groups. Um, corridor lights. I'm going to put this as H2. H2 Delirious. Or corridor lights. Let's save that as a group. Alright, and then we can go here. Groups. H2 corridor lights, toggle blocks on off. So there you can go, boom, toggle the lights off, put the lights on. Is there any real use and will I ever use that button? Probably not. <laughs> but it gives it some functionality. Uh, large display. What we need for you is text and images. And let's just go with uh, random LCD wide number 9. There we go. LCD number 9 has a brain scan on it. That looks like it should be a medical room. We're going to ignore that. <laughs> I can't ignore it. I'm sorry. I really tried. I tried my hardest and I failed. But keep that in mind for future reference. LCD VY9 or whatever. Okay. Maybe all of the bottom ones are. There you go. For some reason it's a picture of a thruster. But it bothers me significantly less than a CAT scan of a brain. Alright. Also, I can just pretend it's the H2O system, folks. Yeah, alright. We're going pretty good. We're going pretty good, I think. No, we can't make that ugly signal. The private sale. Let's have a look. Let's see. How's this look from the outside? Also, we got to wrap. Um, wrap? Yes. We got a gangster wrap. We got to move these around a bit better. Um, can I get a bunch of this? Okay, I'm just going to do this one here, like that, and then Your health do is that there, okay, do Energy that, critical. that, and that, and then we just stick a normal wall there. Alright, we don't really have to worry about that. Okay. Let's get these guys back hooked back up. Gonna have to come through and pr make this all look pretty in the in the future. Here, yeah, let's get rid of Let's get rid of this right now. Sparky, I've already done all that. Alright, let's do that. Can Kind of link that up like there. Let's put that in there. Might as well, not really necessary, but there we go. Um, no energy. I got no energy. Of course I. <laughs> the way I died and fell up against that wall, that's kind of. Okay. We're going to need food and sleep now, aren't we? Why are we up here? It's alright. Um, do we have any water? Let's go. Bags of chips are apparently way more useful than I ever thought they would be. Okay, we have that. Drink some water. Wait a few seconds. Thing. Wait a few more seconds for thing number two. There we go. That should do that trick. Alright. Now where are my elite tools? Come on, Bob. Uh, we got that. Now we just need to put our head down. We gotta rest our weary head on a bed just for like 10 seconds. Not even that. That'll do. Okay. Close. Let's get back to the outside world. Put our helmet back on. Before we leave. Oop. My dampeners are off. Uh, put that on. Okay. Has Bob not picked up my stuff yet? 
Is Bob being particularly lazy today? Or do I have Bob turned off? Wait. Was it... Was it Sparky rolling things up? I might have turned Bob off. I don't know. I'm getting... I'm getting moments of big confusion. Um, it is what it is. Alright. I think Bob's turned off. Okay, give me all of this stuff. Give... Nope. This one. Okay. I think we're coming along quite nicely. Alright. Put that there. Let's put this in there. There we go. We've got ourselves a nice little walkthrough. Walkthrough corridor thing. I'm a bob. Alright. Everything is looking pretty good. And I have to sneeze. Alright. That's better. <laughs> I actually got to sneeze this time. Last time I had to sneeze, I couldn't do it. Alright. So I'm thinking that is looking pretty good. Now, to cover all of this stuff up... I'm kind of just thinking we're going to just do this. Should we do this? Yeah, we're going to do this. And the reason I have to do it this high is because um, all of these. Maybe what we can do, actually. So I don't really want to make it too high off the thing. I think that'll look stupid. Let's just do this, and then we can have like a transition piece from here going up to cover up all of this stuff. You could probably go get away with it going back here, actually. Alright, um... Let's go like that. Like that. Okay. Just kind of blend all of this crap in. Okay, like something like that. I don't know. What do we think? Do we think that'll... It just kind of makes it look less, um... Messy. This hides the mess. And if anyone has ever built a computer before out there will tell you... The best way to hide a messy cabling system is to hide it. <laughs> it's just to put the back panel on, or bury it in the PSU shroud. But, uh, yeah. See, that looks much better. <laughs> Even just that little bit there made a massive difference to how this looks. I think that looks good. I'm not going to bother... I'm not going to really bother doing the interior part up here just yet, because we eventually do have to come through and gut, gut all this so I can put another couple tanks in there. Um, I'm going to wait until I get the two more tanks that we need to do it, just do them at once. So that's not a waste of resources. But we've got this whole area over here now. I don't know what we're going to do with this section. I, I feel like I have to put like a room here or something because it's got this big open gap and it just... I can't, I don't want to... So, so... I will probably like, you know, we'll seal that off like so. Alright. I don't know. The hell's up here? It's another entranceway! <laughs> I don't even know that was there. Alright, well maybe we can make... Uh, we're gonna have to make a pathway now that comes up here somehow. It's the law. I found a hole. I have to figure out what I'm gonna do with it. And I have an idea that I think I'll probably make a pathway. Um, and then we can probably make a... And then this will be like some sort of room. I don't know what this will be. Alright. We'll do that. And then here. I don't know. You got any, anyone got any ideas for what we should put in this top secret little section? Maybe, I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. Anyone has any ideas? Let me know in the comments below. But I think that's going to be it for this episode, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. Again, sorry for the delay in getting another episode out. I have just been busy and I got kind of caught up in streaming as well. I've been enjoying doing that. And I'm going to keep doing that as well. I just got to work out my schedule. I need to do some organization and planning and stuff. So I'll, I'll, I'll get it. I'll, I'll, I'll work my life out. Don't worry. I'm working it out. But that's it for now, guys. Hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, share the video around, ring the bell, whatever other YouTube nonsense. 
Turbo is what well, Turbo yelled. He, he demands that you do it all. It's a, when Turbo says something, you have to do it. Sparky's welding stuff. But yeah, that's going to be it for now, guys. As always, have a good one, and I'll see you all next time. Bye. Back up home. Well, it's kind of turning into a main home right now.